Good morning, Mesa. It's Friday, December 16th, and you are watching JTV News. Now, please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Princeton University Summer, Summer Journalism Program is offering an all-expense-paid journalism and college preparation program for high school juniors. In this program, students learn reporting skills from celebrated journalists, report, and write their own newspaper and pair it with a counselor. Applications are online. See Ms. Harris for more details. Students, do you have a favorite teacher who has done amazing things? Of course you do. The Mesa Chamber of Commerce wants to know. Submit a nomination for Teacher of the Year and your teacher could win $500. Please pick up an application from the Career Center and turn it in before break. Students, do you know an amazing senior who has been a great leader to our campus? Someone whose standards out at school or in the community? Nominate your peer for Mesa Chamber of Commerce Future Leader Award so he or she can try for a $500 scholarship. Take time to recognize that person who has made an impact on you or someone else. Applications are in the Career Center. Pick one up and turn it in for before break. Anyone wanting to compete in the Mesa High Poetry Out Loud contest, see Ms. Bryce in room 109 for details. The state winner receives $200 and a trip for two to Washington, D.C. to compete at the national level. Any teachers interested in obtaining a brochure for holding a class or school competition, email Ms. Bryce. S school competition will be held on Friday, February 3rd. Students, seniors, it's panorama time. Monday, December 19th, right after third hour, we'll begin taking big senior class picture. Please make sure that you take your time to walk over to the gym dressed in your best Mesa High spirit gear before heading home. We suggest wearing Mesa High club sports, performing arts, t-shirts, or jerseys. You can even print props like giant hand necklaces, pendants, and more to show your spirit. If you wish to purchase a photo, they start at only $10, and you must bring money, check, or credit card number with the envelope filled out on Monday to the event. Link Crew is now selling Jackrabbit Nation hoodies in the bookstore. Keep warm during the upcoming blizzard season. Stay fashionable as well. Kanye was seeing wearing one just last week. These savage sweatshirts are going for $25. Don't be the last in your squad to have one. Spotlight One Nights are this week tonight and tomorrow night at $7 at 7 o'clock. $5 per family, two with ID. Find out who done it. Students, please be Mesa and return all overdue library books before winter break. If you have any questions, stop by the library so we can help you. Happy holidays! Attention students, looking for some fun gift ideas? Mesa High Public Library invites you to come to Teen DYI. Nifty gifts on Saturday, December 17th from 3 to 4 p.m. at Mesa Public Main Library. It's free, materials are provided, and you can have some fun hanging out with other teens, making some cool Christmas gifts. To see more activities and events at Mesa Public Library, stop by our library for more information. Good morning, Mesa. It's time for our weekly PIS drawing. We've got quite a few tickets in here. As always, we're going to draw eight or nine or ten winners. And again, if your name is drawn from here, you'll see Jamie in the front office to claim your prize. Okay, so our first winner is Dylan Harper. Congratulations to Dylan. Winner number two. Looks like Iris Hernandez, a junior. Good job, Iris. Get down here in the bottom a little bit. Next winner is Nathaniel Jones. Congratulations to Nathaniel. Take one off the top. Looks like Frank Rivera, sophomore Frank Rivera. Good job, Frank. About halfway there. Buddy Both, Buddy Both, freshman. Good job, Buddy. Next student. 
Boy, we got Dylan Harper again, so we're going to draw a couple, couple extras. Just one winner per week. Looks like Dylan's done a couple of nice things throughout the week. Good, good job, Dylan. Our next student winner is going to be freshman. Looks like Caitlin Martinez. Congratulations to Caitlin. Let's go with three more. Senior Peter Carroll. Congratulations, Peter. Well, two more. This is a junior, looks like Roland Shaw. Congratulations, Roland. And our final PBIS student winner of the week is a freshman, looks like Lillian Urias. Lillian, congratulations. Again, all those winners go to the front office and see Jamie to collect your prize. Thank you. Good morning again, Mesa. Uh, Principal Thomas back here again. What I've got in front of me is a box that is filled with all of the tickets that students have turned in this entire semester. And there's a bunch of them in here. The drawing that we just did for the week, those winners and even the tickets that we didn't draw were all placed into this box. What we're going to do now is draw one winner and that winner will receive a free yearbook at the end of the school year. If you've purchased a yearbook, we'll refund that money for you uh, because the winner here will absolutely get one free yearbook. So I'm going to reach in here and pull out one lucky winner for the semester. And here we go. The winner for the semester drawing for the yearbook is a junior, Ivana McElhaney. Congratulations to Ivana McElhaney Jr. You've won a free yearbook at the end of the school year. Congratulations. Let's take a look at the weather this week. Thanks for tuning in, Mesa, and we hope you have a great rest of your day. As always, carry on.